We're here at La Restinga, the village close to the 2011 eruption and uh, well it's very calm today so there is no sign of volcanic activity but Juan Carlos and myself we spotted this magnificent wall made of pahoy hoy textures. Look at this. So here they have taken pahoy hoy surfaces and uh, they made them into cladding stones and uh, Juan Carlos is going to say a few words about this okay. now. They are very nice as an ornamental, but it's very damaging because they take the, su the surface of the lava make, and they make a, a big damage to lava flows. Actually, this, the surface, the upper surface that is called Paoi Oi from the Hawaiian term of a sea that is very quiet, uh, has many different uh, many different features because the lava flow when it's almost solid continues flowing and make all these kind of wrinkle riches wrinkles uh, yes striped tri uh, corded uh, whatever many things uh, and ropey is, lava is another and this term is the, 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 the lower part it's the inside exactly so if we see this in the other side it will be like this that's right, and that's the inflation from the inside, Absolutely. and it pushes the hardened crust upwards, and then you get these little connections that break eventually once the inflation has uh, proceeded to a certain point. But fortunately, now most of these la uh, la lava fields are protected because in the old old times they this was in fashion and a lot of lava flows were destroyed. Yes, this is a real pity and uh, I just hope that uh, these were coming from an area that was not uh, protected, but I guess we don't really know. Yeah. So I'll bring you along here, uh, just a few impressions here of this wonderful wall, despite the fact that Juan Carlos is unhappy about the use of these beautiful surfaces. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I can understand partly where this problem comes from. And here in the other side of the of the path in the other side of the path there is a quite different lava that is a, a, a a, a lava with a lot of gas that makes it all these bubbles and because of these uh, bubbles they used to make the mill wheels the millstones the millstone to grind the the, the cereal yes and that's why it's called basalto basal molinero molino means mill because it sharpens itself well, the problem is, of course, the fragments are there in your teeth. In the old times, people have a lot of teeth problems because they chew actually pieces, small pieces of this. Of uh, Pasaltico Molinero. Molinero exactly. <laughs> Thank you, Juan Carlos. This wall is beautiful and the instruction on the Molinero basalt as well. Yes, Thank you.